Hello, hello! Welcome back to our channel, Life of Zeons. If you haven't been here before, my name is Zisha, and this is my gorgeous fiance, Bronson. Today we have a bit of deja vu. Is that what it's called? Deja vu? Deja vu, yep. Yeah, for some reason it sounds weird when I say it, but we are currently test driving the ZS, MG ZS Turbo. Is MG, that what it's called? MG ZS Essence, which Essence. is a one litre turbo, which comes complete with a sunroof. Yes, that's right. So, a few of you may know that we recently test drove the ZST, which is the next model up from the ZS. Uh, but it comes with red stitching, which we are really unsure about. And the extra features that it comes with is fantastic. Like, we, we do really enjoy the extra features of the ZST. Oh, definitely. MG Pilot. Yeah, uh, 360 degree camera. Yeah. But we're really weighing up our options and we, as much as we would love a new car with all the bells and whistles, we never came into this experience of getting a new car actually even knowing that existed in terms of a 360 degree camera, MG Pilot, things like that. It's not something that we ever thought, yes, that's exactly what we want without, you know, going overboard. Yeah. And in turn, we can save a little bit of money, which yeah. is nice. Got all the basics and more. Yes, exactly. So that's why we're on the road today, taking this bad boy for a test drive. We absolutely uh, love that it's got white stitching instead of red stitching. Um, so it's very different in that way from the ZST. The screen is quite different as well. It's not as luxurious looking. Um, but it has got a screen and it has got um, uh, Apple, Play. Apple Play. And what's, what's that thing where you can uh, tell? Satellite. satellite. <laughs> oh, that's Apple Play. I think, and you can connect it to the interface on your iPhone. And so then your iPhone app display will show on the screen. And then you can also uh, control everything via Siri if you want to and also the satellite navigation on top, yeah on top of that if you don't connect to your iPhone it's still got satellite navigation in this model yes which is you know everything that we need basically um, this area here I would say definitely does look cheaper than the the ZST like a hundred percent I'm not really too sure about this design here but that kind of is what it is at least it doesn't have red stitching plastered all across the front here and the doors are nice. They've got the white stitching here as well. Mirror to the side. We've got a few spots of rain today, but that's okay. Sunroof. Back sunroof, sunroof, yes. We uh, actually <laughs> came into this experience not wanting a sunroof. But upon reflection, I've decided that I really want a sunroof. <laughs> because we vlog like most of our life and actually having a sunroof means that we have way better lighting way more natural lighting <laughs> <laughs> so uh that might be a bit of a vlog choice decision that i'm making but vlogging is such a huge part of our life so i think i mean today is the worst possible day to actually kind of have it because it's so rainy outside but you can still see there's Remember so that? much more light just going straight. yeah go straight yeah. so you can go in the 80k area that's Good. what i thought about coming this way we can Get her in a pickup speed. <laughs> Put it to the test. Put it to the test. One litre turbo. <laughs> this area here looks really nice as well. I like that. It looks good. Yeah. Nice steering nice. wheel without all the red stitching as well. Yes, there's just one thing we aren't in agreement on about this car, and that is the colour. Zisha really wants white. To be fair, white does look really nice, really slick, and I was obsessed with it when I very first saw these models come out. But I'm leaning towards black, and this one just happens to be a black version that we're driving right now. <laughs> we and are it makes me like it even the more. black version. <laughs> yeah. So, I don't know. Wait, you're leaning towards black, babe, or you're still... I'm leaning towards white, to be honest. <sighs> if we me. got the ZST, I would, want the, I would want the black, because the ZST comes, like, the front is all matte black on the detail, whereas this has the silver detail on the front, which I think looks better with white this doesn't have automatic windscreen wipers does it no it clearly doesn't you have to turn them on but that's fine that's something minor can't have it all turn the button indicators on <laughs> there right we are we picking up speed we sure are oh yeah oh we're over 80 already yeah. jesus it doesn't even feel like we're doing 80. Well, it's got and the seats are very comfy yeah nice and nice comfy being. it's very comfortable being a passenger to be honest 
Now, if I were you, babe, I would probably get in the other lane and go straight through, and then we can turn around at Emerald Lakes. Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. It is nice. It is a nice car to drive. It's comfortable. It uh, has the the speed, the pickup that we want, and. I oh, know, I like it. It's, it's nice. Yeah, I don't really I'm going to try this so. as well. I think it's this button here. It's coming closer. It's a shame we can't actually open it today because it's raining. <laughs> the lighting is already changing a lot. So that's it with the roof closed, which I don't like the look of, to be honest. But let's face it, majority of the time we're actually going to have it open. I'm passing over the reins to Zisha. She's getting ready to test drive it. You excited? I sure am. Am I allowed to test drive it? They didn't take my details. Yeah, you, you're allowed. You're right. Hopefully. <laughs> All right, set it up shop. <laughs> Legs, I can't pull forward because I've got such sore hamstrings. <laughs> yeah. oh, all right. Hang on, let me put my seatbelt on. Oh, I've got to buckle up for this. Another odd thing that they have in here is like there's like a velvet finish or a velvet sticker over the top of here. Hopefully you guys can see that. There you go. So there's a velvet sticker over the top of this and looks quite cheap in life. Um, I think it's quite weird, but I guess it has that, I don't know, what does it do? Make it have that little bit more of a luxe feel. It's trying to be a bit more luxe, yeah. Yeah, I've never seen that before. Not but really, it's you've got your belt on, odd. haven't you? I sure have. I mean, I absolutely love 360 degree camera that the other car offers yeah this one does come with push start though that's one thing you really wanted yeah i did want push start the button in the other one i think is a bit more luxurious though yeah it's got a lot of uh <laughs> additional features yeah <laughs> that just bring you can it, this definitely tell this is like the model down like there's no doubt about it but it's still nice to drive god is it it feels very weird. My my neck feels like it's being pushed forward. It doesn't feel comfortable on my neck. I thought it was quite comfy for me. One thing I don't like is the fact that it doesn't actually have a proper center console here. Because Zisha and I like to, you know, you like to rest your elbow on there when you're oh, does it not? seating or driving. No, oh, that does is it. a huge problem. Yeah, we love that. So uh, it's missing that extra storage there. It's just I got think this you have map. to pay extra for it. Oh, okay, we can ask about it. Glove box, okay storage. Actually, it, that's smaller than our glove box in our car, current car, I'd say. I wouldn't know. Mm, maybe, it's I don't not know. really a big deal to me anyway. I don't really need to store much in there. Everyone's out and about, look at that. What is this, a car show? <laughs> Given the back seats a bit of a test drive. That's <laughs> what it's called. <laughs> test drive, <laughs> a little bit of a test, test you sit. You get the uh, pockets back here, which is good. For all your storage needs. Yep. Don't know that we'd ever need those, but anyway. Just in case. Yeah, that's annoying that that's not coming with it. Yeah. That we need to. Console. We need to see how much they'll cost to have that add on. But I don't think we're leaning towards this car to be I honest. I think we're leaning towards a more expensive one. Yes, and it's not just uh, a little bit more expensive. It's like six grand more expensive. Yeah. Well, well, well. We all have choices we've got to make in life. We do. <laughs> Sunroof's nice though. Look at that. It's called a stargazer sunroof. Another thing that's super important to us with uh, the car purchase is making sure the standard sound system is half decent because we like to listen to some music when we're on the go. And we just put this one to the test and unfortunately it sounds like quite tinny. Like very tinny. Very tinny and cheap and um, so we were like, literally that seemed like it was the nail in the coffin and we're like, oh, are we getting the ZST ZST now? <laughs> oh, oh no. this is such a, like, we don't want to spend that much money but we want something that we're happy with. Yeah. But I think we both are feeling a little underwhelmed. Yeah. Whereas when we drove the ZST, we were like, yes, this is awesome. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> I want to buy it now. 
Yeah, and then there's all the finer details in it. It just seemed a lot more luxe. It seemed right up our alley. And then this one is this. But the red stitching. It's, that's just oh, one thing. It's just the one thing. And I just don't like the red stitching. Well, that is overexposed. I think we're probably going to go back. That's better. We're probably going to go back to the showroom and give it a bit of a test drive, the ZST again, and just, I think that's the best way to do it because that way we're, we're test driving both cars mm. in a close period of time. Yeah. And then that would give, up, give really us- A really true comparison. Yeah, it will give us a good indication about what we're actually after here. This one I do like. I could be happy with it, could be, but there's this, I don't know, there's too many elements that I'm unhappy with, I guess. That radio though. That radio is terrible. Center console. But now missing. I really have wanted. Now I really want the sunroof. So that is like the next model up in the ZS. -T. Yes. That means. That's like the higher model, which is an extra three k. On top of the on extra three k that this one costs. It's an extra six k. So okay, here's the prices. This one here we're sitting in is about twenty six thousand um, dollars for everything. Drive away. The next model up, the ZST, without the sunroof, is twenty nine thousand. Is on. Twenty nine. How do I turn this on? That way. Sorry, I'm just trying to figure out how to turn my window yeah. wipers on. All right, yeah, never mind. <laughs> the next one up is twenty nine, I think, and that does not come with the sunroof. Yeah, that doesn't come with the sunroof. And then if we want the sunroof on the next model up, is like thirty two. Thirty two drive away. Yeah. 32, 33 drive but there away. Is but there's the tinting well. on top. We definitely need tinted windows. And the windows. tinting on top, regardless, which we're going to get, whatever model we go for, is going to cost about $600. And then on top of that, there's $150 for the floor mats. Which seems odd to me, because you'd think when you're buying a brand new car, like floor mats would just... Come included? Yeah, it's no. like... <laughs> you're spending so much money on this car, but you probably don't want floor mats, do you? But if you do... <laughs> Cough up the dollars. Yeah, it's so annoying. I mean, this is nice to drive, don't get me wrong, but I think I like the ZDST more. Yeah. And that is annoying because I hate the red stitching. Yeah, but the, yes, and because you want the sunroof now, it comes with even more red stitching. I See, know. behind my head here, in the next model up, the, the, the big model that we're after now that has a sunroof, has a big red MG emblem embroidered into the headrest of the seat. Both seats. ZST, the fancy car of the lot. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, effective immediately, we're enjoying the experience straight away, aren't we? Yeah. Uh, it's, which is a positive and also a negative at the same time. Positive being, because we actually like the car and we can agree on the colour. Negative, it costs substantially more than what we were looking at before. Oh, but it's nice. But it is nice. It is nice. The features in the middle are different. Yes. So this is the center console. There's this is a 10 inch screen, I think. I think 10 inch. I don't know. This sure, is the 3D, or it's, well, it's in 2D currently, and then the impression to 3D and gives you a complete view of the car. Pretty cool. Now that's the guy we want, people. But look how quick it picked up and then it drove to the conditions and it needed to stop straight away. Now do we have auto auto? Wipers? I think it's meant to have auto wipers, but maybe they don't seem to be auto turning on. Maybe it's over there. Auto has to be switched on, I think. I don't know how to. Neither. I don't know what they mean. But There's yeah. all different things there. Just look at all of the finer details. That is the center dash. So that is a full, I guess, LED screen. Yeah. Shows where your position is on the car. Shows you if, it's a, if the car's up in front of you or to the side of you at all times. 360 um, degree cameras. Yep, 360 view. 
I'm surprised it's not on. MG there we Pilot. 2D view, 360 view, choose your angle. There's obviously a van. You see that van right next to us? That's the van that's right next to us there. Oh, in real that's life. the back one. Very cool. And now we're off. Just the details. This is the red stitching that we're not a fan of. And this one is the big one we're not a fan of. But in order, <laughs> but in order to get this sunroof in this model, it comes with this. But we did just find out some new interesting news. Oh wow, well, I see my blind spot monitoring now. That's cool. Okay, that's really obvious. I haven't actually seen that in action driving any of these cars, but that was very obviously bright orange telling me there's a car in your blind spot. That's really cool. That was good. Now, as I was saying before, we can actually get rid of the red stitching for an extra price. We'd um, have to take it to a car changerer. Person. Yeah, we don't know the name. <laughs> but they've got, basically, they know a guy <laughs> that knows a guy that can do the thing. And they the can thing, do the thing. <laughs> yeah. And it comes at a price which we're going to find out, so that's going to tick things off. But, but it's something we can look at in the future. We yes. don't need to just rush into, oh, I love this car. This is the car I want. Driving this car, I am like, yes. Driving the ZS, I am like, mm. yeah. no. Even though it's six grand more, I think we're worth it, babe. <laughs> I think we deserve it. I think we're worth We've it. worked hard for this. So nice. This yeah. is this is what I'm after. Comes with this center console bit. So we actually got some decent uh, storage up in there. Um, I don't know what what else is different about this. Well, there's actually a lot. Just, there's actually a lot. I don't. <laughs> I just don't know them off the top of my head. We're just going off like the physical the engine features. for sure. Yeah, the You've engine. Got a lot of get up and go on this. This bad boy right here. Yep. This is a 1.3 litre turbo, whereas the one before was just a 1 litre turbo. And the difference is substantial. Like this. You're hooning about. I feel like you're really just giving this some giving this some go, aren't you? I know. You? I'm really confident driving this car. Right. How'd you I feel? Love how'd you feel driving the other car compared to this? A one? bit on edge. Yeah? Yeah. Why's that? I don't know. There's not that there's not enough difference for me to be on edge driving the other car, but this car, I hop into it and I'm like, yeah. This is my car. Do you reckon? Just like the Jimny, I also loved. But I mean, this has got so many extra features for it. A cheaper price than the Jimny, which is why we're not getting the Jimny. Do you reckon you feel safer in this car because of all the extra safety features? Or well, just generally yeah, you feel so. nicer and, and it's safer just driving? It's nicer. And I don't know, it's just nice to drive. I feel like you have more control over it somewhat. I guess because it is better technology. I don't know. It's a hard one, but it's not a hard one. I've made my mind up. <laughs> now we just got to look at the moolah. <laughs> yeah, now it's just the moolah. But when you think six grand long term, psh, money's money. To be fair, we can. Why don't we just buy a Ferrari? <laughs> <laughs> no, we don't want a Ferrari. Well, we we, we, if we had the crazy money too, we probably would do it just because we had the crazy money. But we're living in real life. And in real life, for a lot of people, we can't afford a $400,000 Ferrari. Oh, we're doing 60K in an 80K zone because traffic is so bad. And I can't really give it all the guts that I want to give it. This gives us a taste of what real life is going to be like. We've literally just had to pull into our local Maccas for a bathroom break because we've been with the dealership for so long and both Bronson and I are absolutely busting our bits and uh, yeah so we've pulled into Macca's the decision is made I think the ZST is the one for us because it just has so much more get up and go the radio is really nice I feel more confident driving it I love the 360 degree camera we're spending more money guys Back to the original decision, actually, that we kind of made, but then we didn't like the red stitching and we thought we could save a few dollars, but it's clear, our hearts don't want to save a few dollars, our hearts want the ZST. And I think we're just going to go all out and get the one with the sunroof. I think I do really want a sunroof. That's an extra three grand for the sunroof, automatic chair, and a nicer dash, like, speedo area. So, um, why not? Why not? We deserve it. We've never had a brand new car in our whole lives. We don't have kids. We don't have anyone depending on us. Why the heck not, right? And the ZST as well, it does also have the random added sticker of that velvet feel. 
that is just something I do not understand but anyway it is what it is I guess <laughs> in our brand new car until we actually get our brand new car yeah. we're only about a minute away from the dealership so this is the final time the final look around before we sign the papers so, and hang on are we getting this one yeah okay definitely i already told them oh sweet <laughs> <laughs> you guys know before me <laughs> no, to be fair we do really like this car and the, it's just no comparison to the zs yeah like zs is great but this is the one. This is the one.